And I had every intention and started to do that in my time as active sheriff. And I reacted very stupidly and wrongly, intensely, to a quarrel with my wife on December 31st over a long-standing issue we had about trips to Venezuela and the duration that they would be gone. And what I did, I've taken responsibility for, and I accept that level of accountability. But in no way, shape, or form does that disqualify me from being the kind of sheriff that a high majority of people, 20,000 more people who voted for Ed Lee, who voted for me, to be sheriff in San Francisco. And I think it was evident that in our inaugural, in front of nearly 1,000 people at the Herbst Theater, I know so many of you who were there, you know this. In our inaugural, we laid out what our platform was. We made it clear that it's time to really sort of adopt the very philosophy that the Jim Crow laws that were vanquished yester of yesteryear about what it meant for segregation is very much alive and well in the jail system here in San Francisco. When I look at a disproportionate demography of African Americans and Latinos, a black and brown population, no different than any other county, but I expect more of San Francisco. And I think it, it, it sometimes suffocates us in a level of political correctness that we don't address these issues in the way that we should. And in the same way, the police department, who I think we should be more engaged in the community, and in pockets of time they are, I also believe that the sheriff's department serves as a healthy reminder of what mean to have a more engaged police department, which is why I made that clear in my inaugural. That's exactly what we wanted to do. And these are threatening to some people, and I knew it would be threatening, but no way did I ever expect, no way did I ever expect, and neither did my wife, neither did our family, the level of retribution, the level of just the kind of negativity that was thrown at us once this ordeal had erupted. And that just really depressed us, me, my wife, for three months. I was completely in cave, so ashamed, so humiliated, so embarrassed on behalf of me, my family, all of you, the people who supported me, not supported me, on people of San Francisco, that we just let that tsunami of negativity just sort of set the stage and brand exactly what we've been fighting for.